How easy and how convenient is it for us to blame everything and everybody for the things that we have going on in our lives? There is a such thing as you being a positive and a great person with the best of intentions towards everybody. And shit is rough and you just can't get a break. But most of you, most of you are waking up every day looking for pain, dysfunction, drama, unemployment, being broke, struggling, dropping every excuse in the book about your childhood and the problems and dysfunction that you grew up in that's stopping you from becoming successful. There's two sides of pain that I don't think a lot of people really understand, right? There's, there's one side of pain that's the suffering and the discomfort side of pain because that hurts. You remember what that felt like. But then there's another side of pain that's called effort. It's called glory. It's called if you can find a way to push through pain, there's something greater on the other side of it. Someone's opinion of you does not have to become your reality. And we rationalize with ourselves to where we automatically stop. That's why a bunch of us give up so much in life so quickly. That's why kids have a problem finishing things in today's time. Because as soon as they feel a small bit of discomfort, of things ain't right, oh, they gone. I can't do it no more. Stop just waking up like an accident. What do you want? And then once you find out what you want, spend the rest of your natural life waking up and going after it. Find some reasons that can keep you strong when you want to give up. Find some reasons that can help you get out the car when you want to drive past the agency. Stop being a lazy, bum-ass person that's full of excuses, sitting around on the pity party, coming up with every excuse in the world as to why you ain't winning. You are the reason you're not winning. You keep messing with negative, evil, and dysfunctional people and expecting positive results. See, sometimes we think the pain is what controls us. It's actually our subconscious mind that if we ever tapped into that, that's what dictates most of our lives. Because see, pain, pain is tricky. Because if you don't control pain, it'll control you. We can stay here, get the shit kicked out of us, or we can fight our way back into the light. We can climb out of hell, one inch at a time. successful as bad as you want to breathe then you'll be successful and I'm here to tell you number one that most of you say you want to be successful but you don't want it bad you just kind of want it you don't want it badder than you want to party you don't want it as much as you want to be cool you most of you don't want success as much as you want to sleep some of you love sleep more than you love success and I'm here to tell you today if you're going to be successful you have gotta be willing to give up sleep you gotta be willing to work off for three hours.